Hi, welcome back. I just wanted to put this up in case anyone's having trouble with a MAF sensor. This is a MAF sensor that was fitted to my vehicle by a garage and the engine is just not working properly. And uh, I'll show you why now. I've gone and fitted the correct MAF sensor. I had to go online because it's a, a Japanese import. I had to go and find the exact model of uh, MAF sensor that was needed and it's much different from what's being sold for uh, European cars. So here's a chart and on the left here are some OBD scans I took while the engine was running with the wrong MAF sensor connected and there's a really big red flag here. The volumetric efficiency for my engine is supposed to be about 107 but it's only getting up to about 73-74% and the mass airflow is only getting up to about 60 grams per second which is really wrong for this engine. Now compare that to the charts I'm getting from the correct MAF sensor the volumetric efficiency is up 98-99% the mass airflow detector is showing about 104 grams per second of air going past and overall the engine is running much better it no longer stalls at cold startup and it seems to be regulating itself much better I'll have to drive it for a couple of weeks just to see what the fuel economy is like but the fuel economy was down to around 10 litres uh, was it 10 kilometers per liter so that's that's not very good it should be around 14 or 15 kilometers per liter so I've just put this up here in case anyone's having a problem go online get a volumetric efficiency calculator and you'll be able to uh, work out what your engine's supposed to be doing so here is the volumetric efficiency calculator. I just picked one that I randomly found online. So I'm going to put in the air intake temperature as measured by OBD, the RPM at wide open throttle, the grams per second airflow, and the engine is 2 litres. So the volumetric efficiency is about you know, 109. So that will give you an example of uh, what to expect when you're uh, looking at the OBD figures. So just comparing that you should be up at least close to the 100 mark anyway. So thanks for watching and I hope this helps someone. Back soon.